Step number four, we're plowing through these steps. Step number four is all around social media marketing. We've already kind of started to mention some of these things in here, but some, some different platform specific strategies. There are different things you can do on different platforms to get eyeballs. So user generated content, we'll talk about some of these here. So platform specific strategies, Pinterest, obviously, or Instagram, those kind of platforms are very visual, right? So you're going to want to create beautiful pictures, before and afters, things that really showcase the specific things that you can do for uh, customers in your area, X or Twitter. It's going to be a different audience. It's going to be a different way to reach out to them. You need to be more engaging on a platform like Twitter and talk about different things that are going on ask questions, get the crowd involved, if you will. Uh, so depending on the platform, depends on what actions you take on that particular platform. When it comes to getting people engaged, there are other things you can do. And there are some window treatment companies and awning companies that do this very well. And it is causing more brand exposure for their business. And it is creating more sales, quite honestly. Things like polls, we're thinking about offering this product, which of these do you like better? Or did you know X? Did you know about this thing? You know, and just starting to get people engaged, uh, a live session. Obviously we talked about video already, but going live and showing a behind the scenes, right? Uh, or just coming up with a question and saying, hey, what do you guys think about this particular thing? Q&A, all of these things are different tactics that you can use to in, get your uh, audience more engaged and they will help and Google, Facebook especially watches engagement to to help show you more times if people are engaging you're going to get more eyeballs quite honestly influencer collaborations so the easy one here is people that are influencers in the home decor world uh, but there are other things you could do here maybe just around, local celebrities. So um, ways there are always local news type uh, organizations in your area that you could reach out to and collaborate with them about some new cool thing that's going on. You could also um, help sponsor some sort of blood drive or some sort of an event, right? And use their authority to get uh, more eyeballs on your business as well. So it's not just about home decor influencers overall, but you know, just local influencers that can help you uh, by just by mentioning your brand can help boost your overall, keep saying authority, um, but exposure. That's what I was trying to think of. Just getting the word out more often. User generated content is all about other people creating content around your business. So a great example here is obviously customers' experiences, photos with your products, things like that. This kind of talks a little bit about reviews and it is related to getting reviews, but just people saying, oh, um, yeah, as a matter of fact, they did my drapes and I absolutely love them, check them out. You know, those kinds of things, maybe somebody else is asking a question about where to go and, your past customers creating content that points back to you is a great way to do this. Analytics and optimization. Again, I mentioned this earlier, tracking. Without all of these things that you're doing, without any sort of tracking, you don't know if you're actually doing them correctly, right? Or if they are working or if they're uh, worth your time, right? So make sure that you have different analytics products in place. And most of these are free. So you can see, wow, uh, on Facebook, people are really engaging when we show before and afters, right? Google or Facebook would show you that those particular posts are getting a lot of engagement and obviously do more of that, right? So those kinds of things, all of these platforms have analytics built into them because they want you to, they want you to do it more often. So they're going to show you what's working.